peeps, welcome to the vlog, we are back in business. So today, as you can see, I've already been for a run, the time is quarter to five now, so we're starting super late because it's a work day, not a weekend. So no Team UK stuff today, just my normal training day. The run was probably about four and a half K, I think off the top of my head, that's my usual route. Um, I need to get my weight down, so I need to pop in runs where I can. Plan is we're gonna go hit up Tsunami Gym training session later on. I'm running the class because John's away. Normally I run Tuesdays and then he's the head coach. He runs Thursdays, um, but he's away helping out Luke, who is headlining ACB in Sheffield on Saturday. But unfortunately I can't go, it's my mate's birthday, but he's gonna be there today helping Luke weight cut. And then he's fighting the week after. So hopefully we'll get some cool footage of John's fight. Uh, should go to that. So that'll be good. But now I'm hungry. I eat early because of work. So I'm going to be eating dinner now. So let's get into that. Right guys, so here's the setup. I'm going to start off while I'm making dinner with some hummus and cucumber. And then going to go for something I haven't had in ages. Going to go for some wraps. So I'm going to have fajita. So we've got a mixture of the bell peppers red onion, tomato, and then on that we're gonna have some guacamole mayo, and then we got this smoked mild paprika chicken breast, and then some cheddar too, so should be pretty good. Haven't had the heaters in a while, simply because I don't like buying a whole pack, because I used to eat like a couple wraps, but now I only really have one wrap per time, so it seems a bit crazy that I buy a whole pack, but let's get into it. Here's the final result, guys, so we've got the wrap, Got the cheese still to go on it, and then got the leftover bits that probably won't fit in. Just listening to some JRE while I get through that. Part two of this meal, gonna seem kind of weird because this is gonna seem very familiar, but part two is two packets of porridge oats, and then some strawberries and Greek yogurt. This is pretty much a repeat of my dip, of my breakfast, sorry. Um, except normally I have blueberries and raspberries, so I try and mix up the fruit. The oats I normally have, I've started having as part of a snack when I get home from work, but if you eat too close to the run, you get a stitch. I learned this the hard way, well, relearned it the other week. So I'm just kind of combining it all now, have it as a sweet, dessert but fills you up real good. Now I've got through that I'm going to catch you up on what I had earlier to eat. So breakfast was much the same, like I said switch the fruit plus all flaxseed and everything like normal and then I go five chicken sausages and half an avocado. Lunch was just a chicken and bacon salad with pasta from Marks and Spencers and then as a snack in between those I just had an apple and a banana. As part of my routine before, I showed the protein bar, the Fulfill protein bar. I've cut that out the last couple days because that's like 200 calories. And then as of tomorrow, I'm gonna try and cut out the chicken sausages too because all these little things add up. If you cook the chicken sausages like I do in olive oil, then that's a lot of calories on top of the chicken sausages, the oil. And then if you have ketchup, adds up too. So everything's adding up. So got to start cutting back but anyway I'm just gonna chill out now and then I will catch you guys at the gym at the gym now guys warm-up is underway we'll get there at 10 minutes oh my god this is that right so after the fights last weekend with Luke Rockhold beating David Branch I was watching his body locks and I thought fuck it we haven't done wrestling in a while at the class we can do body locks that's been the theme for this week so Tuesday Thursday so right now we're recapping Tuesday's technique So yeah, what we're trying to do for this technique is really control the hips and we're getting them to step, get them to pivot and then we're shelving the leg with the body lock and then taking them down straight into side control. Yeah, what I like to do for the kind of beginner guys is we recap Tuesday session as a drill because I don't really like doing the physical warm-ups. I prefer drilling, get as much te technique in as possible for the hour session. Right, new technique for tonight, guys, is if they defend. So we're always trying to close down the hips. They go to defend, they hip out, and we re-step in with our back leg and rip them down to the ground. Check it out. And 
yeah, as soon as we're taking them down, we're establishing underhooks, shoulder pressure, and head control. Just to finish off the session, gonna let the guys roll. Starting off with flow rolling at the moment, so just positions. Like, say, if the person on the bottom throws up a triangle, you kind of almost let them. They let you work out, super relaxed, like no submissions, um, and then they're gonna roll properly. I think it's important that people have a mixture of like just pure technical sessions sometimes especially with the beginners they just need to get that reps in get the technique in but then obviously you find out a lot of things through rolling wrestling tuesday we did wrestling so today we're rolling But yeah, with most of these guys level of rolling, it's more just about like getting used to positions and just kind of trying to just find their way really, get their, find their feet with it. Anyway, I'll see you guys at my training level two session. a big dirty wrestling session man's in the background doing a little extra drilling got the other squad there quiet room quiet room but this is the troubles this is the real world troubles i don't know whose blood this is but not cool i'll get told off by master leah the ultimate crep check i like these boots ollie man no no wait till you see it tighten what the <laughs> they're pretty pimp. They are actually yeah, pretty pimp to me. Yeah, that actually looks like my Destiny character. He's yeah. got gauntlets. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it, it goes good, then this gets bad. As well. <laughs> yeah. Right, peeps. Back from the gym now. Um, should probably just explain quickly some of the wrestling highlights there. So, in the level two class, we were doing some kind of specific training. So. There was like five of us, we all did a round and then we did like a minute with each person and with each person we started the round in a set position. So for that minute you start say with double underhooks or whatever against the cage, whatever the position is and then you're live from there. So after that if you break through you're live or if you get a takedown you reset there and then the position changed for the next person in. We all did a minute 
of that with each person. So it's like a four minute round each. And then we did that kind of going up and wait. So the smallest guys start, they do their round because obviously it's more tiring to go at the end and the bigger guys go at there. But yeah, now I'm home. All I've got to do is unpack and then repack my bag for tomorrow as I go straight from work to training on Fridays. Uh, time is currently 20 past 10. I try now to get to sleep or get to shut my light off. <laughs> it makes me sound like a little kid. Turn my light off by half 11. Definitely try to go to sleep before 12. Otherwise I feel wrecked. Like to try to get my eight hours sleep in. Important for recovery. And yeah, no snack time for me anymore at this uh, late stage because I eat breakfast earlier, like quarter past eight. I then finish eating early, so I normally eat dinner anywhere between 5 and 6, so that's kind of my eating period for the day. Anyway guys, that's my day. Shorter vlog today, not an absolute monster marathon documentary like the last few, which have been in the 20 minutes. Shout out to you if you watch the full video, or most of the video, or if you like the video, always appreciate that. Please like this video. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed, I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,